this video has been sponsored and brought to you by Manila Baked. If you guys haven't had your merch from them yet, please be sure to check them out, man. And let's get it started. Ah, what's going on, everybody? Joshua here, back at it again, showing you guys another pickup that I picked up today at the Nike store. And uh, it was a homie's birthday coming up, so I ended up grabbing a pair for him. It is a Jordan box. Uh, shout out to Nike Guilford for holding it down. Uh, this wasn't too hard to pick up. Now these are a pair of Jordan 1s that uh, in my opinion are super nice. So let's take a closer look at it. All right guys, into the shoe. So the upper, you have a uh, mix of the synthetic leather and the tumbled leather at the top right here. So along the, so wherever the red region is, the varsity red region, that is in synthetic. And then the black region is in your tumbled leather. So bang, right here at the front of the toe, right here by the uh, Nike swoosh, and then by the sock liner that's in black, tumbled leather right there. Super nice. I personally would rather have the tumbled leather along the shoe just for overall comfort because I'm a big fan of, just a big fan of it. This, uh, the name of this colorway is uh, Reverse Bread, but on the box, just to give you guys the official name on the box, it says Gym Red, Black and White. So it doesn't really give you much there. You know, for first time sneakerheads, bread is the mix of black and red. It is a very iconic colorway just for the fact that Michael Jordan played for the Bulls the majority of his career. And uh, in my opinion, black and red, white and red, it's my favorite color, man. And the color scheme between these two, you'll never miss. I swear, you'll never miss. Outsole, black, just like your Jordan 1 typical color. I personally like white. Uh, the white um, outsole is a little more, but, but to each his own. And then on the midsole, right here, you have yourself the classic Air Jordan 1 midsole. Nothing too crazy, it's all in a white. And then, so by the outside, you got yourself the stars there as well. And then down here by the midfoot, you got Nike and the swoosh right here. Classic Jordan tongue, nylon, nylon material with the uh, red outlining right here. Jordan Jumpman right there, stitched in red. And like I said, nylon material. And then your traditional shoelaces here of the Air Jordan 1s. Lace tips, nothing too special. And then your basic uh, Air Jordan logo in gym red on the back here you got the classic air jordan logo so this was the initial logo that jordan used for the air jordan ones and the twos and then he switched it up uh into the Jumpman, the most iconic logo in sports history and maybe even like clothing brand history like you could just wear that and somebody on the street would probably know what it is that's how iconic this brand has been that's how iconic the shoe line has been in terms of hip hop culture, basketball culture, for it to combine all together. And even in like popular culture, you know, with movies and stuff, you see people wear, wear Jordans, uh, celebrities wear them too. We wear them, you know, from, from the highest of highs in terms of people to, you know, just your regular Joe. So, regular Joe? Average Joe, average Joe. Very classic, the reason why I got this for him was because, uh, you know, he, he did admire my sneaker collection. I mean, it's not the best, but in my opinion, I love what I have in my inventory. So, so yeah, this is something I wanted to jumpstart him with. I think uh, this is a really nice start to a collection. So, uh, yeah, I mean, you could bet you could definitely wear this with like your casual stuff, your jeans, your shorts, casual wear. You could dress them up, you could dress them down, however you want. So that's why I started with these. Obviously, the highs are probably the more top dog favorite choice but you know for a budget and for just for the sleek look of this and for a good price of $120 can't complain man so yeah you guys that's basically the shoe if you guys have a pair yourself it's very attainable we I got it in Guilford like I said earlier and I had zero issues I hope my homie likes this pair because I personally do I'd wear them if they were in my size but yeah guys if you guys have a pair let me know if you guys are fans of the sneakers or if you guys have any other preferred colorways let me know my opinion this is probably one of the top tier colorways that you could possibly blend together in terms of the air jordan one low colorway so yeah guys uh, i have an instagram follow me there uh, all that other good stuff but for now i'm out take care